guys waiting for? You waiting for a bus? Uh, 200RR tryout and also a 300 cross trainer tryout. Yeah. What are you waiting for? 200. 350. What are you waiting for? More bikes. A lot more, bikes. More, more bikes. More bikes. More bikes. Where are the bikes? Where are the bikes? They're out on the trail. Hello everyone and welcome to the Ballistic Sports Desk and coverage of the 2022 Promation Corduroy Enduro presented by GP Bikes. Pat Gonzalez along with Blair Sharpless and today Blair we're going to take a look back on Super Demo Ride Thursday that actually flowed into Friday and Saturday in terms of the manufacturers but what a great turnout and an opportunity for racers and for consumers to test ride all of those great 2023 off-road motorcycles. Yeah, it was great to see so many manufacturers participate and along with the e-bikes. We had two e-bike manufacturers plus KTM's electric bike and then we had a couple of e-mountain bike or e-bicycle uh, manufacturers here and then we had Stasic, the uh, small little strider, electric striders. They were great for the kids and that sort of thing so it was for the whole family to try bikes and see what fits or what they're looking to buy for next year. Um, we had over, I know one of the manufacturers told me they had over 280 different people try their motorcycles. So it was a great success demo uh, Thursday and Friday and Saturday this year. It was super. Well, indeed, we had KTM Husqvarna along with Gas Gas, Yamaha, Kawasaki, and Beta. And then, as you said, Electric Motion and Saron. But also, we had the folks from Durham Harley-Davidson here with some of their beautiful Pan America bikes. I know uh, that was very, very popular. So the demo ride portion of the weekend just continues to grow. Yeah, Pat, it was great to see Durham Harley here with their Pan America. Adventure bike riding up in cord country is huge. There's lots of great roads, gravel roads, and I hope in the future, a lot more of the manufacturers bring them. Did you know Harley Davidson actually won the cord twice, way back in the early years, I think in the 50s and 60s. And the biggest bike, biggest displacement motorcycle that ever won the cord was obviously a Harley 750. Yeah, and that was Toronto's Gerald Roberts all the way back in 1954, the second year of the Corduroy Enduro. There weren't any demo rides back then, uh, Blair, but uh, our demo ride program at the Cord just continues to grow and grow. We hope to have many more manufacturers join us uh, next year for our Super Demo Ride Thursday that also runs into Friday and Saturday. So uh, if you wanted to ride uh, a bike and you're looking for a new bike, the Corduroy Endura was the place to be. And again, we thank all of the manufacturers who were there for their participation. But also interesting that the test track we used for the demo rides was actually test number one on Saturday, made it very interesting. That's right, Pat. And we've got lots of great coverage of that and much more coming up on future episodes.